everybody, and welcome back to more, I guess, uh, Yu-Gi-Oh! Last time, we were, uh, time dueling, I guess? I don't know, actually. It's, it's weird. We were doing some time duels. If you guys skipped that to come to this episode, I get it. We're going, we're still in Obelisk Blue. Uh, we got here by screwing over Chaz and making him want to quit the Academy. Uh, while we're in Obelisk Blue, I think I'm gonna start bullying Obelisk Blue students, since that's basically all I can do. When I was in Raw Yellow, I bullied a bunch of Raw Yellow students and Chaz, who deserves to be Raw Yellow, and ended up here. So, how the hell did I end up with all these traps? Alright, and I drew both my cannon soldiers. Okay, that's an unlucky hand. Huh, maybe since I'm playing the guy who's all about drawing, um, he got a very lucky hand against me. So I'm gonna set all of this, I'm gonna save the cannon soldier. I'm going to save the call of the haunted. I don't really need it at the moment. There is nothing I want to call for haunting. Alright, Red Archery Girl is a pretty good girl. And sadly, my guy is weaker in defense mode. But if I was in attack mode, he'd be safe. So I'm going to I'm gonna negate attack. I'm surprised he uses a monster like Red Archery Girl. Like, if he was using the Toon Mermaid, it'd make more sense. Because he can draw that using Toon Table of Contents. Which is a card used to help you draw more cards. So, you know, it makes more sense. What the hell is this? Okay, interesting. It's a card to help you summon more cards, so, you know, it makes sense to me. But that's not the case. That's not what we're doing today. So I'm going to go ahead and enter my battle phase and attack. Get as much damage as I can. 1,400, nice. So, Damon, you got lucky. Your power of the draw has made it so I would draw a bad hand, which is sucks, but I'll make up for it. Warrior de Greffer, that's a good card. That's a good monster card right there. That's 1,700 attack. I like Warrior de Greffer. Him and I like Warrior of Zera. Those those cards are cool. Let's see. I'm going to use me Yellow Gadget. Yes. The Yellow Gadget will help me bring out the Green Gadget, I believe. Yes, I believe it's green. And then I'll have the Green Gadget bring out the Red Gadget. And all of this will just be stalling until I eventually lose the duel. Because for some reason, I'm not drawing my Cyber Dragons. I'm not drawing my... I have three Cyber Dragons in this deck. So where the hell is it? Where is it hiding? Alright, there's Skeleton Jewel. No, I'm not afraid of skill and draw. I don't mind taking 900 damage on top of this 500 damage. Go ahead, do your damage. I'm fine with it. Ouch. That hurt. No, not yet. 900 damage. Yeah, you know what? Yeah. The reason I'm going to call the Haunted is because I'll get another green gadget, which will just help me get rid of more cards in my deck. Obviously, I could bring back a cannon soldier, but I'm not in the mood for that. I'm trying to get cards out of my deck. I'm not trying to bring back a monster to do damage. Oh, sh Dang it! I put B! Oh, I wish it was automatic now. Alright, Solemn Wishes is not a bad card. Every time he draws a card, he gets to gain life points. Plus, I drew Upstart, which means I'm going to help him gain even more life points. Which is not good for me, but I'll live with it. Hey, there's a good card. Mechanical Chaser, my normal monster. My only normal monster in this deck. But he does work. So, Mechanical Chaser, why don't you defeat the Warrior Die Greffer? Or, Degreffer? Degreffer? Yeah, it's probably Degreffer. And, uh, why don't my Yellow Gadget defeat the almighty Skellingle? Which, I actually like Skellingle. I've used it quite a few times in my decks, because I got it in one of them starter decks. And, uh, it works out. I like getting the free draw from the flip. It's kind of nice. Alright, Pot of Greed is probably your best spell card. And because it's your best, I'm going to get rid of it. Yeah, Magic Jammer. I like Premature Burial more than, gra than Green Gadget being in my hand. I could do more with it. Alright, let's see what you got now. Heavy Storm, you jerk. My Trap Jammer, my Yellow Gadget, and you have another guy? Oh, but I have Heavy Storm now. Payback time. Alright, and I'm going to summon... This time, my Green Gadget. Because if I summon Green Gadget, that will add a Red Gadget to my hand. And since I haven't summoned this turn, I'll be able to summon that said Red Gadget. Come on, video game. Give me that red gadget. All right, look at that. So unless he played a really, really, really defensive monster, he is screwed. And I get a yellow gadget in my hand just for fun. Just for freaking fun. So let's see how defensive your monster is there, Damon. Oh, good. It's that, that's, the, you get the effect I was just uh, gushing over. Yay, he drew a card. It's actually a pretty good effect. Um, not nowadays, obviously. Probably unusable nowadays, but back in my day... I love to draw one card and have to sacrifice a turn for it. But it wasn't, to me, to me it wasn't sacrificing a turn. I, I, I used to call it Stalin. Stalin for turns. Alright, he got one. And it's Jar of Greed. Okay, that's not scary at all. Alright, so if I use Red Gadget, I don't... Oh, I have Yellow Gadget. I can't get another... Oh wait, I never drew the Green Gadget, so I could do this. 
I might as well. Use that. Now I'm getting the green gadget I was supposed to have two turns ago. And now green gadget, go for the damage. Nice. This gadget deck has really worked out for us. I wonder if I should add more gadget stuff, like the stronghold. The only reason I haven't added it is because it slows down my deck. Because I'm not, I'm not here to stall for time. Like, this duel took a while because I drew a bad hand. At least a bad hand for winning in 10 turns. Uh, but this, this is fine. This is a fine amount of damage we're doing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're sad, Damon. You should be. It's sad to be sad. I know, man. Draw, draw power is important. I'm still surprised you talk the way you talk. You want to know power of draw? I always want to know the power of draw, Damon. You're my new target. You're the not, you're the kid now that I'm going to be bullying. Every time, every time, or every episode, I try to find a new kid to bully. I, I tried to bully, bully the Slifer Red students. They're actually really good. Don't screw with Slifer Red. They're crazy. They got that. They got their freaking uh, ringleader Chumley. Chumley's insane. Seen, I'd seen him kill a man. I've seen him kill a man. There we go. Damn, if only I got a better hand. If I, if I had Cyber Jar instead of Morphine Jar, I could have won in one turn. Well, three turns, technically. Hey, Red Archery Girl. Now I'm glad I played him in defense mode, because in attack mode, she would have beat him by 100. There we go. Get that 400. So this duel's going kind of like the other one. Now, are those both draw cards? Just draw greed? Draw greed or something? Is that, uh, is that what we're doing? No? Okay, it's not draw cards. Well, since I know that now, I'm going to go for the Heavy Storm. Ooh, it was a Magic Jammer. Impressive. In very impressive. Okay. I, I see I should respect you. But I don't respect the weak. So, goodbye. MST, go ahead and destroy that card. Alright, there's nothing I could special summon this turn, so I'm not, I'm not gonna go for no victory. Um, I'm gonna set this because I might end up needing it soon. And I'm gonna summon the cannon soldier because he's strong. Like, unless he gets warrior to grepper, he's strong enough. Steamroid, now that we're in, a, in our bone battle phase, get that bonus 300 or 500 attack, do 900 damage, and then we'll beat him next turn. As long as he doesn't pull anything off, next turn is his last turn. Alright. I got the music kicking up. It's all, everything believes in me. Just like I wanted it to. Alright, I'm holding B just in case. Octoclops, that is a good monster. That is a very good monster. Alright, so maybe I'll have to let him destroy Cannon Soldier. Alright, I knew he'd be dumb, uh, too dumb to attack my other monster. Even though now I'm able to defeat him. Alright, so as long as I summon it, or as long as I draw a really good machine monster, I'll win in one turn. Just one turn, just another 1800 attack. Ah, oh, darn it, it's only 1200. Alright, I guess it'll take a little longer. So right now, I would have 36. I'd have 4,100 attack. Four, oh, whoops, I said no. 41 minus 18 is what? Let's see. If it was 40, that would be 22. So it'd be 2,300 damage. Then 23 from that would leave him with 3,000 life points. This would be 24. Nope, he would not lose next turn. All right, he would not lose this turn. I have to wait another one. And I did it again where I pressed B instead of A. I don't know what's up with me. I need to be more careful. Maybe that's why, because I have to keep doing it here. So this time we're just going to do a little, little bit of damage. And next turn, as long as he doesn't draw anything too crazy, we'll win. How is Octoclops a draw card? Is it just supposed to be one of his beat sticks? Kind of like his Warrior to Greffer? But a little bit better? Oh, whatever it is. He's, yeah, he's living his own life. I'm not going to judge him. Let's see what he can do. We got a 4,000 point difference on him. We're definitely going to win next turn, no matter what he does. I shouldn't say that out loud, but I'm saying it out loud. Alright, the duel is over. Now, how over, how much it is over, we'll find out right now. Okay, I'm going to offer my yellow gadget. Yes, I know you really want to activate, but first let me do this. I'm going to destroy this card. Or not, I will destroy it a different way. Uh, we're going to go into battle. Get my Steamroid going. My Steamroid has the same attack as my Blowback, so I don't mind attacking with Steamroid. Hey, it's good old Mukamuka. Muka. I think his boss monster is Enraged Mukamuka, Muka, which is a cool card. Do not get me wrong, it is a very cool card. And then he's thinking, oh, I still have one more turn to come back, and then it's... He, I've been in this situation too, Damon, where it's like, oh, never mind, he's been holding back a limiter removal. What a jerk. No, it's my turn to be the jerk, Damon. Yeah, I can't believe you lost either for the umpteenth time. I don't know how many times I've beaten you. Too many times. 
Yeah, you and your draw power problems. I'll find you again. Alright, there's the nerdy kid. I already bullied him. Joined a seance crew. Alexis, I don't like bullying you anymore. We've 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 spent too much time together. There he is. He's he's at the harbor. You know, the last person I saw at the harbor ended up quitting the school. His name is Chaz. He's also at Obelisk Blue. So if I duel you one more time, does that mean you'll also leave? Also, did you know you're very easy to beat? I've beaten you twice within ten minutes. I wonder if I could do another one within five. All right, this is the first time I'm going second though. This is awkward. All right. Not bad, not bad. Is it just... Re oh, it's Reckless Greed. I like that. Now you're not going to draw for a while. Which is fine by me. Alright, Cyberjar. Yeah, get us a good start. Let's bleed through this deck of ours. Okay, he had to skip the draw phase. Ooh, who cares about the draw phase when you have something as strong as Muka Muka on the field? 2,100 attack point Muka Muka is really good. Sadly, Cyberjar was my first card, and that's that's really sad. It's only limited to one. Oh, he has Polymerization? What the hell does he want to fuse in that deck? Hey, Poison Draw Frog, that's cool. Ooh, Yellow Gadget's good. And Red Gadget, good. I got two good ones. One. I like getting these because I'm just going to get a bunch of... If I had a Muka Muka at this point, I'd be a, ma I'd be a madman. If I get Snatch Steel, you have no idea how strong I'm going to get. Oh, well, you could. You could calculate it, but you don't do that. You mean there are no cards? Oh, I probably already drew them. I, they're already in my hand? That's how unlucky I am right now? I can't draw them because they're already in my hand? Darn it. Alright, Solemn Wishes. Yeah, that card will help you. And I did notice I don't have anything to stop your spells and traps. So I guess that's pretty unlucky. But in the end, I don't actually care. Alright, I'm gonna go aggressive. Now I have all three gadgets on the field. Now I wish I did have that Stronghold card. Even though I do have it, I just haven't put it in the deck because I don't really want to. Uh, Poison Draw Frog, you're going to face the Yellow Gadget's Wrath. Darn. Darn, Damon. I was expecting more from you. Now draw two... Oh, okay. I was going to say draw two cards, but no. Poison Draw Frog is draw one card. 1400. And since you have to skip your next draw phase, then oh, you kind of made up with for it with your Poison Draw Frog. But that means that you're stuck. Unless you happen to draw something really good with that frog, you're in trouble. What, what is this? It's, oh, it's Wabakoon Call the Haunted. Great. They always try to activate. Red Archery Girl. Okay. Okay, she's at the same level as my monsters in my hand. You're, you're right. She's strong. Alright. No, I would like to win, so I'm going to stop you with a good old negate attack. Oh, crap. Do you have Wabakoon? Or seven tools, I mean. And luckily, since Wabaku isn't a flip effect, it's just to activate whenever you want, I can activate it now. It's not a it's not a flip one, so bam, you can't kill my yellow gadget. I get to keep it. Alright, main phase two, he ends his turn, and I'm going to end the duel. You know what? Red Archery Girl wasn't the worst card you could have drawn, but since I have a bunch of strong monsters now, like Mechanical Chaser, the duel is over. I was gonna say summon Cyber Dragon, but I like having all three gadgets on the field. Let's uh, let's just enjoy that for the moment, you know? Just enjoy it. All right, 450. Right, Archery Girl. That's right. She's done. Green Gadget, take him down. Nice. Okay, so we beat him in six turns. That's pretty good, in my opinion. Pretty freaking good. And I don't think we didn't even take any damage. Oh my god, this guy sucks. Damon, how did you make it to Obelisk Blue? Don't get me wrong, a draw power deck is really good, but it's really good when you use something like Exodia. You're using nothing. You're using Enrage Muka Muka, which it's not nothing, but it's not enough, you know? You need more than that, Damon. You need more. All right, I'm only going to bully you once today, so if I find you, I'm going to bully you once. I do want to know the power of draw. Teach me powers. Teach me man who speaks horribly but looks like a total nerd. That's the weirdest part. He speaks like an ape man, but he talks like a nerd. Plus, I think in the Japanese version, his name's like Tizan or Tar it's like a it's like supposed to be Tarzan, but they called it Tizan. Alright, I have one I have I have the combination to instantly win the duel. 
Alright. I can't believe it. I can instantly win on my first turn. That's how good my hand is. Alright. I'm just gonna hope he doesn't get card destruction. That's all I can hope for. If he gets card destruction, I lose the best hand in the world, which would make me cry. But, I don't know. He's... He hasn't had any trap cards to stop me either, so this would really be the end of the duel if he doesn't summon anything. Upstart? Ooh, even more life points for me. Thank you. Oh god, yeah, this this duel's over. That was that was a sad, sad duel. Holy crap is this duel over. Guys, I'm gonna activate the power bond. Our most powerful card. We're gonna fusion our most powerful monster, our boss monster, the Cyber Twin Dragon. I love this card. I know I said I hated it way back when Zane was the only one that had it, but now that I have it, oh my god, it's beautiful. And then, I know what you're thinking. I summon the Blowback Dragon, just to guarantee that that face down can't do any effects on us. Let me do that right now. Alright, let's see if we get lucky. Oh my god, this is just the perfect turn, ain't it? This is just perfect. Now we're going to limiter removal, because screw this guy. In three turns, we have won the duel with 11,200 attack, but we're still going to attack with 4,600 first because it's funny. Damon, this was your worst game yet. Oh, you hurt no much? This is going to hurt a ton. They had to stretch out the numbers. Yeah, you're done. I've already got a lot of money for three-turn victory. Oh, holy crap. Number of turns 3, DP earned times 5. Holy crap, that was so worth it. 2,000 points, or 2,000 DP just for that. That is, oh, that is beautiful. I could, I, I almost want to duel him again just because of how quick that was. And you know what, I'm going to take a break. Let's, let's go to sleep. We got a test that we're not going to take next week because of Crowler. Alright. 1, 2, draw! 1, 2, draw! What me doing? Same exercise and training as Bastion in Raw Yellow. Me skills increased. One, two, draw. Okay. We have a new pack today. All right, new pack, huh? Uh, Master Fusions. Uh, ooh, Expert 3. I've been wanting that. I want that Black Luster Soldier so badly. Uh, what's the new pack? Ooh, another one of these girls. Okay, I'll buy a few of those. But I really, really, really want this Black Luster Soldier. It's so cool. If I can get it, I'd put it in a deck immediately. I'd have to make a new deck, but I would. Alright, Spark Blaster. So this is this girl's. Dragon Mirror's kind of cool. White Ninja's not bad. He's done a lot in time duels. King of the Skull Servants is not bad. Two of them is even better. Alright, let's see. Something, something. That's not too bad. Carpet Girl's funny. Good thing I made a bunch of money before this. How hard is it to get that card? I bought so many. I bought so many. And I still couldn't get them. No, I want to try again. I don't know how often I'm going to be able to buy this expert level 3 pack. Give me it all. I'll spend everything to get Black Luster Soldier, please. Although, couldn't I just enter in the password? Don't, you know what? Don't think like that. That's lame. I'll do it if I have to, but right now I'm trying to get him the good way. Through packs. Come on. Come on. Oh boy, this isn't looking good. <laughs> Oh boy, yes! Yeah, we got him! Holy crap, heck yeah, I have never felt so happy. We got the rarest card in this pack, Black Luster Soldier, Envoy of the Beginning. Oh my gosh, I should just add that to my deck now because it's awesome. Even if it doesn't fit in my deck, it should go in my deck. I don't have to take the test, so I'm free as a bird. There's nothing special I have to do this afternoon. Everyone's nervous about the test results. Tomorrow's Saturday. So we don't even get to see everyone else's test results, but we did it. We passed the test, everybody. Great for us. Not actually great for us, but we, we passed, so that's something. Um, I want to go shopping again. Damon, give me a second. I need to duel you. Yeah, I'm only going to duel you, like, one more time. I need to... I, I just... I, I know, I know, guys, I shouldn't bully him the entire day. I should mix it up. But I got so much money off of him that one duel. I want to see if I can do it again. And then next episode, I'm probably going to add that Black Luster, because, God, it was beautiful. Oh my gosh, I can't believe we got that. That was that was lucky. Alright, I'm going to start with Reflect Bounder in case he does summon something pretty tough. Set this, set this, end my turn. No, end my turn. Thank you. Thank you, video game. Alright, what's the card you wanted to draw? Mooka Mooka, that is the perfect card. That's one of your best monsters. 
But luckily for me, Rifflet Bounder does not care. You take all the damage that you would have done. There we go. I'll take the 400. And then, let me just go right here. Call it the Haunted. Get me my Reflect Bounder back in case he tries any funny business yet again. The more he attacks me, the harder it'll be for him. Alright, now... Red Gadget, Cannon Soldier, Giant Trunade, ooh. Uh, let's not summon the Red Gadget. Let's set the Red Gadget. Then let's end our turn. That'll be the difference. Alright, what's now? Warrior DeGreffer, yep, that's that's a good card, but I don't think it'll destroy my Reflect Bounder, so... Oh, what? You're not gonna attack my Reflect Bounder? Come on, do it! Kill yourself, Damon. I didn't draw the perfect hand, so now I have to duel you normally. Man, you're lame. Did anyone ever tell you that, Damon? You're a lame duelist. You could have been so much cooler if you just attacked my monster like a good person would. Just, just let Mooka Mooka do it. Attack me. Attack me while you have six cards in your hand. Oh, boss monster time. Even better. Attack me with that one. Yes. Uh, wait, no. Not yet. Not yet. Ooh, and you're bringing back Warrior, aren't you? Alright, good. I'm liking this. He's got his boss monster out here. Rage Mooka Mooka. So this is his time to, to shine. This is his comeback. Alright, Can Soldier, you just gotta die, buddy. And normally I'd Wabaku for you, but I want him to attack me. And Rage Mooka Mooka, do it. Alright, now that he's attacked, I think I can still get the effect. Let's see. When this face of it is attacked by a monster in your opponent's side of the field before down to catch his resolve. Okay, good. So I can still activate this and the effect will still go off. Yep, look at that. He still takes all the damage. Am I going to win this duel by... Re Wait, Wabaku couldn't save me? What? Wabaku didn't save me? Alright, how much attack does it have now? 28? That's too much. That's too much, man. So I'm going to have to do something else. I'm going to go for the Premature Burial. I'm going to bring back Reflect Bounder. Oh, I will not chain that. How much attack does he have? 18? He's too much. Um, I could go for the Jinzo, but then I would have problemos. Uh, Giant Trina is not too bad, but I don't want to use it just yet. You know what? I will. I'm going to Giant Trunade. If you Giant Trunade in this game, you actually can use it to get uh, Premature Burial back. And then, using that, we'll get a Cannon Soldier. And then, using Cannon Soldier's effect, we can make it so... 500 damage. Uh, if he attacks us next turn, he kills himself. He, uh, now he doesn't have a choice. So I think we did it, guys. We forced him to kill himself. He cannot defeat us. Let's see it. Oh, nope. He, yep. He just lost. He played himself, everybody. And that's going to be it. We defeated Damon for the fifth time today. And next time, we're going to continue bullying him, but uh, we could save it. We'll save it for next time. So thank you all for watching, and goodbye.